viewers and sub good day blessed sunday to everybody blessed sunday big up all our subscribers old and new subscribers you know loyal ones disloyal ones big up to everybody so i'm here talking about a story that that came across in the star this story happened in saint catherine said that um the husband and the wife had a dispute and the husband used a pickaxe as you can see from the picture above can just imagine a pickaxe when you used to dig grave at Jamaica. The husband used the pickaxe and kill him wife with it. Yo, I can never your wife that. I never am wife, man. Well, somebody out the road that do him something. Cause can't have the heart to just use a pickaxe and just murder your wife like that. Yo, that's sad. That's yo, that's beyond sad. So it says that a St. Catherine man, Eager Knight, was reported kill his wife, end his life by drinking weed killer. So him drink weed killer and kill himself. Yeah, I'm kind of yeah. Now I'm also glad same dead, but him deserve it. Him deserve it. Now I wish dead for nobody, but if you kill your wife with a pickaxe, yeah man, you deserve it dead, but. That was my thoughts. Now it was suspected of killing his wife, Maria Lee Russell Knight, otherwise called Lisa. She was 43. And that's on the housing scheme of all of us in Catherine. Reported that about 2 p.m. on a Wednesday night at their home, a disagreement developed with his wife, where he was accused of being unfaithful. It's alleged that night, night, grabbed the peacocks and went to work on his wife sick man after she collapsed then he grabbed a bottle containing grandma's zone and tried to kill himself before running into the bushes and as son he was chased by a relative and was seen consuming the poisonous substance the police were summoned at night who held by the police taken to Spanish Town Hospital where he was admitted into serious condition and then later died. To me never die fast enough. Because in a matter what disagreement you and your wife have. Yes, and then we know that sometimes having a disagreement in a household can lead to serious argument, can lead to fight, you understand but we know at times you're so heated in the moment that you not think but feel it better if you get so heated and then you just better you just walk away and then come back to the person later on and then have a different discussion but in the moment when you know he, both of you guys are heated you're not gonna say stuff you're not gonna do stuff and sometimes just like this leads to death and then what so now husband gone wife gone our wife gone, husband gone, two of them dead. You understand? Know Didn't say if they have any kids or not, but if they have kids, now the kids are, are mother and fatherless. You understand? Know to know if the relative them can't take care of them, this is, they won't end up in the system. Some foster care, and I'm not going to say Jamaica is the best. There's no such thing as a good foster care, because foster care out there is always some crap happening, them take advantage of the kids, them, or something. So, for this man to kill his wife and then use grandma's zone and then try to kill himself and run out of the bush then see him consume the poisonous substance, that can be avoided. But then again, if I saw you have to go, I saw you have to go. You understand? Please say, yo, if God called you a certain way, if your life was ordained to go this way, I just saw it all go. You understand? I would say, yo, when death come for you, they come for you. There's nothing you can do to change it. So, but maybe this could be avoided. I don't know. Just saying. This, this right here just seemed like it's just stupid to me. But it's just sad that both husband and wife, or wife or husband, or whatever you want to put it, lose them life over just a dispute in the household. To be honest, do you agree with? The way the brother take him life. Do you feel that that is justice enough for him to use a pickaxe? As I said, the force are come with a pickaxe. 
when you use it you use that for your wife and kill your wife with it so let me know your thoughts and your comments in the comment section below do you agree your face say yo yo him them should use the pickaxe for them see when all in him dead do him some gruesome killing me no no just i say just let me know because this is just sad i said i don't know what going with saying catching enough lately uh saying catching now is bad but still big up to everybody who live a saying catching you know just be careful just try hold it down because you always seen like nowadays like the crime rate uh, spiral back up again you know i knew it was still going on but state of emergency in certain places you never know, really hear about so much killing you know we know killing still are going killing not going to stop i just part of life as the people ladies on the tv they are defenders of the earth so leave your thoughts in the comment section in the comment section below and let me know what you guys think let me know what you guys think as i always say subscribe to the channel when you start subscribe the gods arise and we crush all our enemies you understand we have a free vibes cartel we have a free bojo free enchant storm free carrier jones you understand for some real reason i can't remember the youth name but free him also you understand so we now have to say freedom is a must so like share comment and subscribe and like and share the video have a blessed Sunday, and I'm out.